Afternoon, fellas. It's good old Raptor Jesus with another playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2. I always forget to add the two. I just call it Red Dead. Yep. So I doubt if anyone even remembers the first one or if they even remember Red Dead Revolver. If you do, you're a true OG of gaming, really. <laughs> Or you just like uh, checking you out the old games, now? even though they're old, they're not bad, you know. I myself enjoy playing old school RPGs. Uh, mostly I'm poor and I don't like buying new editions every year. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I'm still playing uh, Red Dead here over on my PS4. <laughs> So today we're trying to get the old Reverend uh, back home. He's a bit out of it, you know. He had a little bit too much to drink, I guess. Almost ran in that tree. Hey, look, we're we're back. Easy now. I hardly use these hitching posts. It's kind of funny. Good job, girl. All right, Swanson. Let's get you to your bed. Well, I was wondering when he'd show up. Let's lay him down gently like. Uh, so he can head to his sweet release of sleep. <laughs> you better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, just like dropped him on his just chin head. <laughs> Poor bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky. This time. Real lucky. Yeah, he almost got taken out by a freaking train. I'm always losing my hat, fellas. Ain't that something? Those things never seem to stay on. Guess let's contribute what I got. So you got a couple things, you know. Nice gold watch. Yeah, those are nice. This should fence or something, you know. I usually like keeping money to myself. That's my cut. I do all the hard work. These lazy bones here. See if they even have any stew. Man gets hungry out there all robbing and saving folk. To be honest, all I really do is play poker and save a drunk. <laughs> okay, John. Not you again. Please don't hurt me. Oh, my favorite activity is messing with this guy. Comfortable there? I can't even lie down, it's agony. Ah, oh, stop moaning. How are you? Not my usual self right now. Oh, that's no good. Okay there? Trying to get some coffee now. Why are you 
following me. You're just in my way, ma'am. Uh -huh. I'll take a little bit of a nap after that, fellas. got all tuckered out after all that fun adventure dealing with the reverend but I did learn how to play poker which is pretty cool that's sort of my favorite thing in games I think I must be the only one that actually knows how to play caravan in New Vegas but my buddy used to run a run a Fallout pencil and paper role playing game back in the day when New Vegas just came out and he was really into Caravan. He had the strategy guide for New Vegas so he was just pulling stuff off of that to use. You know we we only really played D&D &D, so back then it was kind of hard to get new systems unless you had a lot of money. So I guess it's still true now. <laughs> But uh, he got the caravan uh, deck of cards with the rules in it, and we would play it. All it is is four hands of uh, blackjack. Uh, each deck is supposed to represent a different community. And all the cards have little like things, kind of like... Uh, you know, your trading card games. Because the idea is you're supposed to use... Your deck is supposed to consist of cards from different playing card decks. Yeah, as you're, like, picking up all that stuff from the wasteland ruins and such. I have a cool idea for a game, but... I made a character in New Vegas uh, that just had max luck. And I kept getting kicked out of all the casinos. That was my goal. I just kept winning too much. You know, and I don't like that in casinos. They want to make money, so they cheat just as much as you want to cheat. It's just who's the best cheater. And sometimes you can get past their little uh, handicaps they give themselves. They give themselves an upper hand. So that's how they see it as handicaps, not really cheating. But I saw to like wake up from old Arthur's nap here. And see I got myself a hat again. So hope you fellas been enjoying my ramblings. If you do, please like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. You know, share my videos around because I have no idea where I should be even be posting these things besides my Twitter account. And uh, leave a comment up below if you think I suck and, and want me to do something else besides ramble on while Arthur takes a freaking nap against a rock. <laughs> Let's get back to the uh, gaming, right? Let's do something more wholesome. Arthur? I'm gonna talk to old Karen here. You wanna talk? I don't know. I just don't feel myself. Been out a lot. Sure. Anything fun? Nothing bad. I've seen all these people who needed help. Just ignored them. That's it. What? Uh, auto save once again strikes me. <laughs> also killed a bunch of innocent folk. I don't know why. What's wrong with the art? They looked at me wrong, fellas. I just I get swear. so angry about everything, about how this is gonna end. 
Well, it'll only end well if you keep your mind, Arthur. We need you. I know. You know, so it is, you know, if you feel alone. I had a fellow know me the other day leave the server, which is unfortunate. They've been pretty helpful, so can't really seem to contact them, but I guess that's how it is. Good morning, Morning, dear. Hopefully they come back to us. Arthur, Dutch, I need you to do me a favor. Nothing too serious. I need you to help Herr Strauss. I've been working hard, Dutch. I know, and I know Strauss's business is not too glamorous, but it pays. Please, son, for me. Okay. Oh, sorry, Dutch. Wake up, Arthur. To try it. I'll live on a moderate diet. I'll not drink, but I'll deny it. In a shut the alehouse door. For that is where they tell us. I just can't escape his siren song, fellas. But I by the poker and bellus. I'll never get drunk anymore. There he is. The Lord blesses us this morning. A drink in your hand. What a surprise. Just a swift one? Well, it's your life, not mine. Yep, and all right. Are you well, Mr. Morgan? Well, I'm alive, Miss Grimshaw. These girls, Mr. Morgan, they're driving me to despair. Why? No gratitude and no manners. This younger generation, it saddens me. The world is ruined. I know how it is, ma'am. I know how it is. All right, well, I should be getting on. Well, just go on. Let's get some coffee, fellas. Mm-hmm. Enjoy this calm and swift morning. We'll get to these chores, huh, fellas? I swear these people, we, they never do anything themselves. They're gonna about freeze to death if I don't get them some old firewood, you know? Besides, I'd rather do these chores and help out all our Strauss. Oh, look at that. There's that little man. I don't know what he's up to. Yay! More wood! <laughs> Keep at it there, Arthur. I guess I chop wood for real, old fellow. That's a really cause. No, no, lazy adults. You know? Morning. Old Jack. Hi. How's the reading going? I'm getting better. Good. Well, keep it up. Bye bye. 
Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss? You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loan it. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. <laughs> Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss him so much. Of course you do. It goes without saying. Oh, what am I going to do? Oh, lady. You're going to suffer. Well, whatever else is in store for us, Arthur, I'll tell you one thing. What's that? The rare old pleasure not to be freezing our balls off up in those mountains. <laughs> You're not wrong there. Be well. And you, Hosea. It's nasty out there on your own. I know. Hi, Arthur. My lady. You'll be safe here. Everyone behaving themselves around here? Hardly. Well, I'm sure you have it under control. Fine, whatever. Miss Morgan. You seem chipper. But where there's life, there's hope, my friend. And? We've been thinking about our problem all wrong. All wrong. That's all. Meaning? All in good time, my friend. All in good time. <laughs> Always the show, man. Well, let's get to it, fellas. I hope you've been enjoying these. Uncle. Warren Arthur. What you got going on? Nothing much. Yeah, that don't surprise me. Yep. See ya, fellers. Hey, fellas, that's the rest of my video. I hope you're really enjoying this playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2. I think it's such an excellent game. And I hope you guys are enjoying the story as much as I am. And I hope you keep your uh, shield arm strong and you have a good game next time because it's really important to me that you guys are having fun in this dreary, dreary world we live in.